podcast, Kevin with RogueDeckDealer.com and also Morton here. Morton's going to be piloting in Scred Red. Um, this is Nate Man Q, and I'll just turn it over to him. We've got four lands here. Is this a keepable hand, Morton? Yes, I think so. We got Lightning Bolt, we got a turn three cough. Yeah, I, I agree. So, so more, I'll let Morton do most of the talking. He'll, he'll commentate mm -hmm. as the game goes on about. What you can do. commentate if you want to. All right, yeah. Yeah. So let's see what you're playing against. Mm. It, this could be a scape shift. This could be infect. infect scape shift. Yeah. Oh. I doubt it's that's... infect though. Oh wow. You rip a blood moon. <laughs> that's good. It's against infect. I really don't hope it's scape shift. I... That's not a good matchup. Okay. It's, it's look... probably scape shift. It's looking like scape shift. Yeah. But he doesn't have the journey, so no. or search, search for tomorrow, which is what really yeah. makes the deck very explosive. Is a turn one search. Hmm. It could actually be spin the twin because they play one off. Well, it could be tarmac. Something ground. For sure. Yeah, I'm just gonna play Mindstone. Yeah. <laughs> if they counter it, I really don't yeah, care. If they remand or not, I think your play is Blood Moon next turn anyway, right? Not yeah, so. it depends. It depends. Oh, it could be burn. No, this is twin. Well, it's yeah, twin. You're, you're right. This this could be burn. Yeah. Yeah. But. No, not with his steam vents. It's twin. Yeah. I guess it still could be escape ship. They play lightning bolts. Hmm. Okay, so I actually think I want to play Blood Moon here. I agree. That's because I really don't want to. I want to pretend I have more than just a lightning bolt here, so I don't want to play the card and just untap a mountain. Yep, I agree. So he's got he has to act, he has to react to this. I guess you could have the combo because he's got it just turns it all into Yeah. But we can't just sit and do nothing, so. And as a pester might you're still fine. Yeah. So it's got to be a deceiver exarch. But he still has to have a, a fourth land and the combo piece. Spin the twin, so. Okay. Now I'm a bit confused here. Yeah, remand. No, it seems like. Snapcast. This image. still seems to me to be scape shift. With a basic forest. Yeah, I'm just going to Lightning Bolt. The Snapcaster? Yeah. He's probably going to. In well, combat. Huh. I think. Do you know what? This still, sh this still could be Rug, rug Twin. I don't know. It's maybe I'm just going to lightning bolt this. Yeah, that's no. fine. You never know. This could be. There used to be an old rug deck. It might see favor again with Eternal Witness, Aether yeah. Vial, Snapcaster Mage. It He's was probably a very going to... efficient deck. Okay, now I'm a bit confused. My money's still it... on Scape Ship. I think it. Yeah, but I'm just surprised you've not played any actual what it's called a uh, mana ramp. Or something. He just didn't have it in his hand. Yeah. It... Okay. <laughs> it's not good. Not with, with our hand, at least. Now, now I'm thinking. Now I'm thinking. Okay. Now I'm thinking it's Tarmo Twin. Maybe it's Tarmo yeah. Twin to escape shift. So. I really don't want to put an artifact in the graveyard. Yeah, it makes sense. So, I actually think the there. play is just to play the cough and maybe gain for life. If he attacks cough, I think that's the right play. Since we have two coughs. Yeah, that's, what do you think? That's fine. You can play the scrying sheets here or the. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I guess so. Because you won't have enough to activate it. I guess you could before your upkeep, though. Yeah. 
just gonna untap him. I don't think I could attack with a mountain, but he may just block it. Yeah, I doubt. I I I think he would just block. I don't think it's worth it. No. So we we got a bit mana flooded here. But so... he, he, he could. Uh, he's attacking it no matter what, right? Yeah. I don't think there'd be yeah. a reason not to. Maybe it's wrong to play there. But I, I don't know. This could be a rug twin. Um, I think it is. Yeah, it is it is going to be a rug twin. Which I guess would be a little bit tougher of a matchup for you, right? Or would it be about the same? I don't really know. Uh, I hope I rip a relic here. Yeah, I think yeah. I have to... Uh, yeah. I think I have to do that. Oh! There's so, the relic, so... Just cough and relic, right? Yeah, I think so. Do you, you have enough, yeah. Because you can still play a... You'll have a land on tap, too. And I'm going to play this and attack. Right? Yeah. So the, what I could do is actually attack with a mountain and then play a relic after. And then one of his guys will die. I think that's actually the play. And I exile a creature. What do you think? That's fine. That's that's fine. It's What do you value more, a mountain here or a goy here? So and I, I think that's fine. Or four damage if he, yeah. if he blocks. Yeah. Okay. But we still have to be aware of... Twin combo? Yeah. Yeah. So let's see how he attacks. Me? Okay. Yeah, I'm fine with that. So I'm just going to crack the relic now. Yep, that's fine. Yep. Oh, nice. Yeah, we're going to be very good here because then it really puts him in an awkward So he's position. going to lightning bolt. Okay. Definitely is running out of steam. Oh, excellent. Then you don't have any counter magic up. So we are probably just going to... That's a lot of lands, but I'm probably just going to tell Mountain and tap. And play the worm now. That's not bad. He's he's down to nine, so it's nine up right now. So yeah, yeah, and yeah, you have to attack the cost now. Yeah, he does, and he's got to lose his uh, a goy fear, and yeah. you gain six life. Yeah. Okay. I like that. Reman Fortko. Hmm. What's the thought scour in here for? Yeah, snap cast image probably just okay. some kind of value card. I don't. There's no Delph Castle, well. too. Yeah, yeah. You can sure. put some other stuff in. Yeah. So we're just going to Ultimate Cough and take the game if it does not attack. Oh, Lightning Bolt. Uh, Snapcast that Lightning Bolt. Uh. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And that's that was a good thing. Just drawing you that relic turned the game around completely. Yeah. So I think the Blood Moons are very good. So I'm not going to take Sideboard in Boil. Because it's kind of a non bow with blood wounds. Uh -huh. What about Molten Rain? You think? I don't know. I, again, it's one of those things I don't think it's bad. Um, I'm but not, but I'm not the problem is, I, I do not know if... I don't know if he's playing the combo. That's the problem. He, he has to be. Yeah. So I think I'll take in... I'll probably take in two raining volleys. Not the combust? Yeah. 
if you if it's not playing the combo, it's we just saw no piece of the combo at all, even through the fault scour. So you think this may be Delver though, Rug Delver? Could be. It could be. But again, we only know one card that running that Wally is good against. Nay, as it's not good against Snapcast Mage anyway. But yeah, so how you're you probably don't need the angers and the volcanic fallouts, right? Unless I think the fallouts are decent with relic. I guess it kills Goyce. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't know if they want the anger. Yeah, so I don't probably... think about the anger unless there's some some sort of kitchen finks that comes out of nowhere. They, really, there's, I still there's like not the... a lot of terrible cards or terrible choices here. Um, oh no, no. Because molten rain would be fine to bring in. Yeah, and... I, I could see that it's a one-off. Well, you don't have to. I'm just saying that that it it'd be a fine choice. To bring. It wouldn't be a dead card. You'd find something like if he's playing cryptic command, which he probably is. Just locking him out of that third blue source can be. But I don't think he's playing a free yeah. islands. Yeah, I know. Well, it kind of looked to me like it's been forever since I played against it. But it there used to be a deck with Eternal Witness and yeah. Aether Vile, and what they try to do is just keep recurring Cryptic commands and lock you out that way. So I'm just going to figure out what I'm going to set out. I'm thinking about a Mind Stone or a Southern. I think Mind Stone is pretty clutch here, though. Okay. To, I mean, it does make his Goyce bigger if you have to sacrifice it, but getting into that early Worm Coil or Koth. Yeah, I think, I think I'm going to take out a Roof. No. Storm Breath, maybe. Probably. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I think I'm yeah, I mean, again, there's no really wrong or right choices here. I think everything is pretty, pretty yeah. solid. Okay. <laughs> It's not a good hand. It's at not all. a bad hmm. hand. No, it's, but that's what I don't the... like about Blood Moon. But I think we're we're going to keep it anyway. So yeah, you're on the. Since we I end don't the know if draw, you keep this on the play or on the on the play, but on the draw, I think you keep it. Yeah, you'll see. He's just going to fake basic basics now. So. Yeah. Yep. Which slows him it's... down, though. Yeah, exactly. And he may not play some threats on turn two. Because he is afraid of a blood moon, he wants to counter it. So, but I really hope we draw a relic or something soon. Yeah, that, um, that land was pretty good. Yeah, so relic is probably the best card in this matchup, I think. Yeah, is Goyce already a, a what a two three? Yeah. So, yeah, okay. So, even though he has eight ancient grudge, I still think we have to play. It's gonna the be mindstone. Mindstone's fine. Mindstone is gives you some mana next turn to actually. Yeah, but the problem it it's, it buffs his. It does if you buffs. if if it dies. I don't think you'll yeah. be sacking it anytime soon. You might just get beat yeah. down by the goyf aggro this game, uh, but. Okay. It gets us closer to the Worm Coil engine, which is... Okay, this means he does not have an Ancient Grudge. Yeah. I don't, would he bring an Ancient Grudge versus you, though? Yeah. Why? I think so. For Relic? Because Relic? Already... Yeah. So, ooh. So this is actually a tough play. I think I'm just going to pay, play the Relic. And then hold up square for Pestamire. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I'm just going to tap the scrying sheets. No. No, because I want to scrying sheets. Yeah, if, if, if for whatever reason. He could have ancient crutch. So I would like to find sacrifice this to draw a card. But I really want a fourth land, so I think. Okay, so we're just going to exile a card. So, this is probably Rock Twin. I think it is. 
Okay. Maybe it's not. So I think I'm going to take the two dimension yep. search for land there. It's still taking two damage of this deck with the worm coil engine in your hand is not Man. not a big issue. You're so, not in range of getting snap bolt snap or bolt nope. snap bolt. So he's going to cast a spell sky. Okay, he is definitely twin. Twin. So I actually think I'm just going to play the script on the Tamagorf now. That's fine. Yep. Yeah, I think I have to. And just exile the relic uh, because it's going up to a free fall now. And just pop this yeah. in the turn. But I'm a bit confused for actually, so. Yeah, I don't know if I'm a fan of the Tarmo Twin. I think that regular Twin is just a lot more consistent. Yeah. Or even um, Jeskai Twin. Yeah. Because Goyf, I, I understand that Goyf can be a great card in certain matchups. Oh, roast. So. So I just think I'm going to play. This is actually a pretty hard decision. Yeah, I'm with you. He, he, well, he can't really do much end of his turn. He can remand. I, 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 so I just think I just think I want to be aggressive here and uh, play the cough. And if he remands, it's it's okay. I don't know if I want to play the blood moon and shut down his his green mana. Yeah, I don't but know I, I I I think I want to be able to play a worm coil as fast as possible. Yep. So. And this way, he has to make some plays too. If he sticks, he has to. Okay, he's going to remand it. Yep. Okay, that's fine. So next turn, if we do not draw land, I think. Yeah, I don't know. So I think we have to roast the spell card here. Okay. Yeah. I'm still okay with that. I think we have to, because if we place a... Pestermite? Yeah, we just auto lose. So I'm going to tap like this. Oh, Good. you can actually handle a Axarch because your scrying sheet's a snow land as well. Yep. Yeah. If he remains, I think we're just going to play the Blood Norm and cut him off green. Mm, if he remands, I still think you... Oh, no, yeah, because then he can't twin. Yeah. This is actually uh, pretty complicated. Yeah. Yep. been a lot of complicated. Yes, okay. I think we're just going to play the Blood Moon now. Uh, but he, no, he can no, we can't. We can't. Yeah. we can't. We can't. We can't. Yep. Yeah. Sorry, I just... Uh, I should not have said this. That was stupid. Okay. Yeah, still not the worst thing ever. You have the four mana. Um. So I'm just going to try to play Koth again here, probably. It depends on what we draw. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. And since we have a second cough, we can actually attack with the land this turn. Uh, since we have five mana, we yep. can attack with the... So that's what I'm going to do. Or you can negative him. And... Yeah, I don't like blood that moon. Blood Moon's not that powerful at the moment. No, it's okay. Snapcast or remand, okay. Pretty annoying. Oh, 
the blood wounds. Yep. You're keeping up pretty good card advantage versus him, though. Yeah. But I don't want to go below. Yeah. Okay. So I um, just think we're going to play. If he draws a land, if he taps out now, we're just going to slam a worm call if he draws a land. If he draws a land. Yeah, I've made one mistake this game, so. I think we still just play a cough. Yep. I just want to play the land because he could have something like Is it Charm or something. So Yeah, I'm sure Is it Charm's in the list. Yeah. Yes, it resolved. So we so just we could actually to... generate five mana and do worm coil engine here. Nah, I don't like it. What if he has yeah, that could be the play. Huh. But then it, yeah, it does push you vulnerable for the Snapcaster Mage. Yeah. To attack in. Yeah. It could be. You think he'd want to mana leak that or get rid of the cough here, though? Yeah, so you probably don't have any. I think he's gonna try to combo off here. I think that I don't know. It's it's definitely up to you. You're the pilot here, but if you negative two caught, that adds five, and, this and we can still can still leave up scred. Yeah, I think that's a good play, actually. Yeah, let's let's try that. I don't think you have. I think he would he would have used something against cough. And you have a backup cough anyway, so. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's his deck, I don't think is going to be ulting anytime soon with lightning bolts and and whatnot. So I'm surprised if he has a rematch. Yeah. No. Yeah. Wow. He didn't even do anything. It's. Yeah. I'm still thinking Pester Mind's coming out right here. Yeah. I'm just going to scrap it immediately. Okay. Yep. So we're just going to and he's gonna target kill it your snow-covered mountain. Yeah, he could tap down this, try to kill a cough. Yeah, that's true. But we're just going to kill yeah, it. That would have been a better play, actually. Yeah, it would. Uh, so he's going to get punished for that, for sure. Because now he can't. Okay, so now we got some knowledge if we're going to the third game. Yeah, his play probably, if I was him, I'd just put the twin. I so I'm just... I'm on a Snapcaster and start getting value out of it to try... Any any um, chance to yeah really come back in this? So I think I'm going to play cough and just pressure him. Yeah, and you're dead to the twin combo if he has it, which is unfortunate. But... Yeah, yeah. But he may try to play around potential moon yep. spells. So we're just going to. Except like this because we can yep. scrang seeds instead. So let's hope he does not have the combo here. But I don't. A good twin player would probably not just try to go off right now. Well, he might have to go for broke here. He might have to just say, this is the only way I win. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So he's probably going to, if he does not have the combo, he's going to Ancient Grudge, the Worm Call now. Yeah. Okay, so he's going to tap down this card, I think. If he, okay. Ancient Grudge is it? Okay, he can still do that. Huh. I don't know if I like this play from him. 
Yeah. I would probably. Uh, yeah, I don't know. He's probably has the. Yeah, I think he has the combo right. Yeah, so. I'm pretty sure he does. Yeah, it, he's got a debate where he wants to go for it though. Yeah, but we could not play around it in any way. So we're just going to try to fake that we have. Blood Moon is probably not that good against him anyway. Yeah. And now he's searching so, for basics. Yeah, so we could leave one in after sideboard, maybe. Yeah. And actually... I'd I bring think, in the Combust. I yeah. Think he's gonna and, rely, and, and the think Boil. He's gonna get you with Goyfs. His only way to win yeah, this I'm, game is twinning. Twin combo. Okay, he does not have the combo. Or he's just good. scared. Yeah. That's excellent. So he's just going to kill the cop. Yeah. It's, it's pretty to... hard to try it. It's pretty hard to ultimate cough against lightning bolts. Yeah. Okay, that's a really good draw. Yeah. But I still think we're just going to leave it up. Don't cast it now and well, just do it on his turn. I would have Blood Moon there because then he had forces Ancient Grudge. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. But he was just he would have done it anyway if, if he played Blood Moon. Yeah. So I'm not going to activate the scrying sheets here. Because I want to be able to play this through, uh, uh, what it's called, uh, a remand. Yeah. yeah. See, this does, I don't, Blood Moon actually shuts your own scrying sheets down here. I don't know if that's a big issue. Yeah, but he could potentially have Tamagoyfs. Yep. And I don't want him to play Tamagoyfs because they're pretty good against my so if he's going to mana league it here. Negate it. Okay. That's, that's awesome. It gets a negate out of his hand. So I just think we're going to Blood Moon and play this first to play around the uh, Spell Pierce and then play Blood Moon. Do you agree? Play Scred right now on Deceiver Arc? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Because then I can play Blood Moon afterwards. Yep, that's fine. Yeah, I didn't just play with them. Okay. So let's hope we draw. A, if we draw a rending body, I don't think we. It will be pretty hard to lose this game, I think. Yeah, and he's he's really cut out a cryptic command mana now. Okay, Karanos. Now he's just going to splinter twin on the Snapcaster and start trying to get value out of it. Okay. So what does he have in his graveyard? He's got a Serum Visions. Is that it, though? And two Eight. Lightning Bolts. Lightning Bolts. Yeah, it's got to yeah. be... If I were him, because it gives him a block... Well, it actually gives him a way to kill both in your Worm Coils. Yeah. But he's tapping his red. Both red. Oh, because he yeah. probably wants to... Dig with Serum Visions. There he yeah. goes. No, that's... Okay, yeah. I, I'm thinking this is a Splinter Twin on the Snapcaster. Yeah, I think you're right. So, we need to draw something good here. And then he's going to bolt off the... Lifelink. Lifelinker. Yeah. When you attack him. So, it's... It's it's turn 10 and he has only drawn 5 lands. That's... Yeah. And he's almost... Through half his deck, so that's pretty unlucky for us. And I'm not going to play this land. So, so he gets a block as well with the. Yeah. How can he only have drawn 
five lands. That's he 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 fetched for one of them. Yeah, that's pretty unlucky. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. Still in decent shape, though. I mean, you're only one worm coil or batter school away from really taking over this game. Yeah. That's actually a nice card. Yeah. Because now I'll force his hand right now. And now he can't Snapcaster Serum Visions the following turn. No. Yep, so he's got so... a bolt off. And that's another bolt out of the completely out of the way. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, of course, that. Yeah. Yeah. Never yeah, mind. Yeah. I'm still there's no reason to attack no. here. Yeah, I forgot about get negating his his board. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Yeah, Splinter Twin is value on Snapcaster for sure. <laughs> yeah. He might just have, yeah, he might have the second Splinter Twin at this point. Yeah. But he used his negate. So, again, he might just be a little hesitant to... Yeah, I think he's just going for it here. There's no reason not to. Yeah, because if you would have had it, you would have had it, yep. Yep, let's... I don't know if we could try to time him out, but... At this point, your time's almost as bad as his, so... Yeah. Yeah, let's just concede. It's pretty bad not to do it. I think when they have the combo. Okay, that was a pretty intense game. Yeah. yeah so I actually think we're go going to two blood moons goes out. I actually, maybe the combust comes in. Yeah. And boil comes in for because he's going to. Yeah. He's going to get a lot of basics. Fetch for yeah. uh, basics. And... I don't know if I don't really. It doesn't seem like it's the a key component to winning the game. No. Hmm. Solemn just seems a bit slow. I maybe actually won the pirate spell bomb. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Again, Normally, I don't think, uh, I don't think also, Rain's very bad here. You think it's good? Yep, it can cut him out of the the one. I don't know. It's it's iffy because sometimes it's that it's that awkward turn three. It could be good. Man, he drew he drew like five lands that last game. So okay. Mm, let's just try it like this. I think, yeah. Okay. Ugh. Yep, that's not what you want to see. Okay, it's decent. But I really want to draw a relic. Mm -hmm. Or something like combust uh, bully. And then I'll just keep it in my hand until he tries to combo. Was that that was a uh, three to see for Exarchs last, last game and yeah. two twins. Yeah. Out of and he was just halfway through his deck. Yeah, five lands. Yeah, it's pretty unlucky. Okay, this don't get mana screwed now. So we're just going to try to play Blood Moon this turn if you draw land. Yeah. And shuts off all his fetches. Yeah. 
Go if, no, okay. Come on, land. There we go. We just going to the end of Blood Moon now. If you remand, if you remand, it. Yeah. And next turn we can't play it if it draws land. So, yeah, can't do anything about that. So if you draw, if you draw land next turn, we can play Kaf with a yeah, spread. Yeah, you're, you're not in any threat with Splinter Twin without no. seeing a red source so far. So I really hope he plays something like Sim Vision here, so we don't have to play around the combo. Yep. But he he's actually okay. So oh, that's also good. But we can't play anything here. Yeah, it's awkward. Yeah. So he's probably going to fetch through red land. Okay. He just has no red mana right now. Yeah, I don't know why he wouldn't go get a steam ants there. No. Okay. I'm just going to let the res resolve and see what it takes. Maybe he side out the combo. Yeah, none of these are very good options. You have triple ways to kill his light. But I think we, we have to kill this. Yeah, you'll you'll want to bolt it. It's just yeah, bolt it. But he, he's probably going to take his friend. Yep. And ah, I could see him taking the the cough here. He could take nothing actually. Yeah. Or the board maybe. Yeah, he took nothing. So I think we're just going to yep. uh, just bolt it immediately because he's probably thinking I don't want to give him the mana. Yeah. So I agree with that play by him. Yeah. So if you draw, okay, okay, that's good for us. If he, so let's hope he does not draw land here. Put a card on the bottom. Okay. Bottom, bottom. Yeah, that works. Yeah. Now, Blood Moon's kind of weird here because uh, you give him that yeah. red source. Yeah. But, but you can actually lock him out of. But then again, he did blue. not fetch any red cards, so I think he bought out the combo. What do you think? I don't know. I have not a clue. It's always a puzzle with a twin. Yeah. Knowing Scred Red and knowing twin, I would probably... I don't know what I'd do. Jeez. I'm almost inclined to double script this. Yep. I mean, it's fine. I, Blood Moon wouldn't be too terrible here either. Now that he's got, other than that, gives him his double red source. Locks but he has all these colors, so. But again, it's there's not really no point in playing it. What do you think? Yeah, either double scred is fine. I think you can take some hits from Goyf. The problem is if if you don't kill Goyf right now, he could just keep up counter magic and temple you. Yeah, and the problem if is he negates one of the scrits. Yeah. So Shout right now is it. your opportunity to. I think we have to. Yeah. And just pray. Man. So I really hope we draw a compost uh, rally here and a volley.
Yep. So if you draw a land, I'm going to instep kill his islands. Okay. I think that's the best play. Yep, that's fine. Lightning bolt. Yeah. It's kind of weak at this point. That's fine, though. We could. Nah. If he taps out for cryptic command, I'm fine with that. If. Oh, jeez. That's lovely. He could have a negate and a spell pierce, but I still think he'd go for it. Yeah, I think so. Come on, Resolve. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, he's taking his time, so he probably has an answer. Snapcast a remand. Whoa, he had the cryptic. He still has mana too, which is the. I think I have to play. Uh... Yep, you do. But this probably means he has the negate. Yeah. No? Okay, we should probably have played it the last turn. I don't know. No, he had cryptic. No, but I, on our turn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I did not think he played cryptic at all, so. Yeah, roast that, so that's fine. Yeah. I think he would have counted this if he had. Yep. Counted. Sorceries. Yeah, yeah, see what this one's to do. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. So I think we have to roast this and yep. attack. Results. He can't even snap remand here. So. Okay, I don't think it's. If we ultimate cough here, I don't think we can lose. Yeah. And I don't think it's correct to try yeah, to yeah, cast Yeah, worm quills, you don't need a worm coil right now, there's no threat. So. No. But he could have something like. No, he don't have a cryptic command in hand. He could have Snapcaster in hand. Yeah, sna Snapcaster Bolt could kill off your cough, but you have yeah. Spread. Yeah. Okay. This is potentially a very close game, and I don't want to give him the second red land. Yes, <laughs> I, don't I think agree. So. Yep. So. Okay. Plus, Blood Moon actually ends up being pretty bad. Yeah. Oh. Crap. I now think we, I think we spread here. this. I think we have to. Yeah, because we just any sort of counter yeah, magic. Yeah, just let him play the lightning bolt first. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And just kill it. Now. I think we have to. Yep. So, don't have. Okay. We still have a very big threat. And if he casts like a Garf, I think, okay. Something combust. Okay. I think we just have to, I don't think we can risk and play a Wim card here. I don't want to tap out. No, 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 just, yeah, just keep pumping up cough. He could just, I don't know what he has in his hand. Got no idea. Oh, Jesus. Still missing that red source. Yeah, he probably has it in hand. Just combo us up. Maybe it's wrong to play the 
Don't have it, don't have it, don't have it, don't have it. Yes. So a lightning bolt or anything would be good here, just not a land. Do you think it's time to play worm card? Yeah, if you don't think that cost's gonna be, yeah, I guess that's fine. But I really don't want to tap out. Maybe he's just waiting for us tap to tap out. out. You would. You'd only have one land tap. Nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you have drawn like, I don't know. This is really hard. I think. Yeah. Okay, it's your decision. It's my decision? Jeez. Yeah. I don't know what to do. Yeah, I... Does Wormcoil actually even do much? It still puts him on a... He, he, block. he could just... I think he, I think he has Ancient Grudge in hand, so it won't do anything in any yeah, way. Just, just plus up the cough then. Yeah. Play your other land too, and just... Geez, no relics Trade. so far, huh? Yeah, that's pretty. That's rough. And no combust uh, volleys. So now he's in the range of two lightning bolts if you top him. Yeah, but he's also dead to this one if he does not block the cost yeah, next true. turn. Yep, next turn we, the volcanic fallout will kill him. And it can't be Maybe it's turn. just. Please don't draw a red sauce here. He's used quite a bit of his. Has he used his Serum Visions? Two of them? So his ability to dig is pretty. Three of them. He's three, three of them. them. Yeah. I just think he's sitting with a lot of counter spells in Okay, this is very good for us. No. 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 Damn it. Why did he not attack? I don't know. That's perfect. I think we can, we can sit here and wait. You could jam Blood Moon right there too. but No, I don't want to give him the second red. You have Rending Volley now. Yeah, but... It, yeah, okay. Yeah. We should probably play that. It only really... Yeah, it, it might actually fix him better than hurt him though. It helps against Cryptic Command, but... That's it. Yeah, okay, now we're going to play. Yep. Absolutely. Yeah, just going to play land and play button on here. If he has a cryptic, this is his only opportunity. Yep. Well, I mean, he could get another basic. But we have to beware of something like double... To see you exile or something. Well, no, no, you just, whatever he just tries to twin is what you're going to be killing. Yeah, but he can, if you play, play Worm Coil, he can tap down the untapped. Yeah, 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 exactly. So, so you need another land to safely play the Worm Coil. And we have plenty of time right yeah, you're now. You're on a 15 turn clock. Down to one. Yeah, now you have double insurance with Volcanic yeah. Bolt and Lightning Bolt. So any spell with anything with draws is good here. I don't... Cough is excellent. Don't have anything. Remand. Okay. Yeah. You need like even a scrying sheets wouldn't be bad here. To help you. Oh no, yeah, blood moon. Yeah. That would be bad. So okay. Okay, he's trying to go off. No, sir. It's an intense match. <laughs> Down to four minutes and two minutes. Yeah. But, yeah. 
Okay, I think we have to play a bit faster. I really don't want to time out or something. This is a long ball. Oh man, this is a tough decision. I think, I think we have to jam it. Yep. Just play it and see what it falls. I really don't have, hope he has a. I don't think we could play it any differently. We could hold up a volcanic foul out and a diamond ball, but okay, maybe this is it. Okay, on his upkeep, I'm going to bolt. Yeah, there's no point. He would have tapped it down if he had a deceiver. Okay, upkeep, bolt it. He can't win now. That's fine. I think we won this game. All he has to do is go to your untapped phase. Hey! <laughs> Barely oh, pulled that, that off. That was an intense <laughs> match. That was a very, yeah. very, very intense match. So we're going on to round number two. Yeah. Um, well played, yeah. Kevin. Well played. <laughs> <laughs> this has been Kevin yeah. and Morton from RogueDeckBuilder.com. We'll see you in round two.